Hey guys, welcome to the Small Town Critics Podcast. I am your host, Mo. And as you can see from the title of the video, we're doing another bracket. DC movies, so this is going to be a fun one. It's very fun. Yeah, so I'm going to start introduction. So we have a special guest today. I'm going to introduce yourself. Hello, I'm Mark. Yeah, I'm here for the DC. Yeah. That's 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 too that's too. I gotta say it, man. I gotta say. Right, it. I gotta okay. say. It. I gotta the say. DC. It. He's on job. 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 All right. <laughs> hey, it's Kem. Always Kem. Will will be Kem <laughs> until somebody pays me and I'll change it. <laughs> Alias. <laughs> Mohammed Hashi. Let's go. All right. Uh, we're just gonna get started because yeah, we're excited. Okay, so we've got 16 movies. There's a lot of DC movies, guys. So I couldn't put everything in there. I went by like IMDb, Rotten Tomato rings, stuff like that, and kind of played my own list from there. And also, I'm, I'm intrigued to see what kind of list you've got. Yeah, to be honest, this is gonna be quite cool. And also, animated movies. We obviously a lot of DC animated movies would come out on you know DVD or whatever it is. But there's been two that have been theatrically released and they're both on here. So oh, good. if you're looking for that, that'll be on here too. But yeah, uh, 16 movies, same thing as last time. One of the guys is going to pick two numbers and those two movies are going to go against each other. Then next round, next round, next round, and then just go like that. So, Mark, it's your guest. One awesome. to 16, give me two numbers. Let's go with four and nine. Four and nine. Okay. I regret this. <laughs> <laughs> so... We've got Batman Returns, the sequel of the 1989 oh, Batman nice. movie. Wow. Going up against Joker, Joaquin Phoenix. Ooh. <laughs> That's unfair. That's not fair. It's can crazy. I, can I pick again? <laughs> so fair, first of all, let's quickly just go through the most recent Joker because that one's a bit devi uh, devi divisive even. Um, for me, I think when I came out of the cinema, I actually liked, I actually liked the movie, but then when I went on the rewatch, I was like, and I watched it, but I like I rewatched it like six months after. I was like, oh, maybe what? I'm wrong about this. Yeah. No, I mean I I watched that and I thought, yeah, I get where Joker's coming from. Yeah, and I <laughs> I, I I bought it on I actually own it on 4K. So nice. I so I was like, yeah, I I I've watched it a couple of times, yeah. and I was like. Yeah, I get you, man. I, <laughs> I get it. I get it. I get it. I mean, yeah. if I was in your situation, I would have done. And oh, what what a film! Yeah. I absolutely loved it. Hold I up, mean, hold up. Yeah. You don't like it? Well, the reason why I thought it was, I, would, I think on the rewatch, it's a lot more heavy-handed. Is it too much of a downer? Of, no, I wouldn't say downer. That's not the issue. I think it's more of in terms of the theme of kind of loneliness and isolation. Yeah, is kind of like laid on fairly th like thick. Especially towards the end, I, I think thought. that's the point, isn't yeah. it? Because he, he is a lonely human being, yeah, and he's a weird human being, troubled, yeah, uh, yeah and he's yeah. a sort of no one wants to give him the time of day. Yeah. And it is apparent when he goes on that talk show at the end, yeah. they still don't really want to give him the time of day, yeah. And that's and, yeah. I, I, and, and the one person he loves is mom, finding out that oh, maybe she's. She yeah. don't like him. The stuff with, <laughs> the stuff with Thomas Wayne and stuff. Yeah. That was his breaking point at the end mm. there. And then he that was him. messed up. That was yeah, that was yeah. Proper. it was crazy. So mm. even with that woman, that is all that, that whole relationship in his head. Oh my was god, just bonkers. Yeah. And I just thought, what a nice twist. Yeah, and I just, that is a pure Joker <laughs> twist. Right yeah. There. yeah, but did you think the whole like him being kind of worship the end? You think that was a bit? That was a bit too much. No, I think no, no. Well, let me jump in. Yeah, go. No, not because I'm talking like. If we relate it to the, the, the comics, he's always had like a cult following. Yeah. Always had a cult following. Yeah. And even in the, um, I don't really talk about it in case it might pop up. Even in the other Batman, even like they all, all the Jokers had cult followings. Mm. And that's a part of his sort of arsenal. Yeah. He could do stuff and he might be attacking you on one front over here and another front over there. But then you find out that it's his is his is his following and he related to Head. all of those lower class people exactly all of them anyway and that's and that was the key wasn't it i mean it's like if if that was to happen in this current climate today yeah. yep. would we have the same sort of following with one guy saying right you know sod yeah. it i'm gonna go and do this would someone do that i think that we would have the same sort of wouldn't scenario. be surprised isn't it? No. yeah yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Go on. Who's going first? Man? No, what about, no first? What, what about Batman Super Returns? Oh, you can't. It's Michael oh, Keaton. Oh, this Michael is. Keaton. I just, I'm going to put it out there. I, I recently rewatched it for this, and I tell you, I absolutely loved it. I, I loved it again. I've got Michael Keaton tattooed on my back. <laughs> uh, so you know, I love no, the first has. film. 
I love the second film. Yeah, I'm being serious. Yeah, serious. I'm being serious. serious. Honestly, I'm right, right across the back, the old Michael Keaton one on the back. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, no, you got the Batman, the heavy. That's <laughs> crazy. No, I absolutely loved it. I absolutely loved it. And I tell you what, people complain about Batman not using guns and not killing. Sure. Clearly, have not seen the first two Batman yeah. films because he wasted people. Jesus, there was one where he, <laughs> in Batman Return, there's a whole. I think he um, took down one of the whole of the, a warehouse full yes. of like thirty people. Yeah, yeah. He's like, yeah. Blew it all up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was like, nice. yeah. I was like, yes, I was on board of that the whole way. So I'm, <laughs> I'm completely one. biased here. So I mean, yeah, this was the one with Penguin, right? That's right. Yes. Penguin, Catwoman. When Cat- I was a kid, she Penguin fighter. terrified me. Serious. The way he looked. <laughs> I, I, I even totally even now, the way he spoke now. If you rewatch yeah, it terrible. in 4K yeah. remastered edition, yeah. and you see all that stuff coming out of yeah, his yeah, mouth, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. it's, it's so scary. What, what's, what's it? What's it? What did you watch it in the game, Rock? Oh, 4K. Oh, 4K. 4K. Yeah, 4K. Yeah, Master Edition. He's going to come up again. 4K. <laughs> <laughs> right. If you're going to do something, you're going to do it right. I'm surprised he's got a steel block. All right. <laughs> All right, let's do our picks. Mark, go with you first. Batman Returns or the Joker? Batman Returns for me all day. Yeah? All day, all day long. Yeah. Love it, love it. Actually? Of course, of course, Batman Returns. Really? I'm not going to lie, I'm Joker all day. Joker all day. What Joaquin Phoenix done in that role for me was just Hold on a second. Incredible. What are we gonna do if we come to a tie? No, 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 no. You don't have a pick. There isn't a tie. <laughs> you don't have a pick. Sit down, you don't have a pick. You All right, I'm gonna sit this one out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it, has, it has to be like, yeah, 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 yeah it's done. Right. So, so, Bam, so you lose. Do, do, do the pick, do the pick now. <laughs> I would've been on your side. I would've been on your side. Oh, okay. All, All right. right. It's, 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 it's too of a, too much of an iconic oh, thing to get rid of the, the Batman. And that's terms. why I am so looking forward to the Flash, the new Flash movie. Yeah, because he's back again, and he's he? back. Let's 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 because I, I want to talk I about it. Excitement. I want to talk about <laughs> it, not now, because if we talk about it now, we don't, we won't give the justice and the time that it needs to talk about it. All right. Okay. Well, Batman Returns has advanced to the next round. Hashi, two numbers: ten mm-hmm. and seven. Ten and. Seven. Oh my, no! Oh, oh no, no. Where is it, where is it, where is it? <laughs> okay. It's the most recent The Batman, Matt Reeves. Oh. Versus The Dark Knight. Oh. Why are you doing oh. this? Oh I love this, I love this, Ooh. I love this. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, man. let's do it. These are the half conversation we have to have. All right, let's chat do it. to me. And, oh. and I'll start, I'll start, I'll start. Go ahead. As you know, I have a deep appreciation for Robert Pattinson and Ma- Ma- Matt Reeves' Batman, yeah. The Batman. I, I really like that film. That's a quintessential seven out of ten. It always will be great. Hey, really, hey, I feel like I feel like you're dissing yeah. it. Yeah, seven. Yeah, I was like, what? Hold on a second. No, no, let him land. Let him land. Let me 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 land. It has fantastic action set pieces. It it had a great kind of tone in terms of like the very dark tone it kind of like portrayed the kind of like kind of bit emo stuff like that. Great um, score as well, um, but for me. The Dark Knight. Like, I don't care what anybody says. Yeah. Performance is 10 out of 10. It's undisputed for you. Set piece is 10 out of 10. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's, it, it's, it's one of the reasons why the Oscars became 10... Um, uh, Movies. 10, nominees. Uh, 10 new nominees for Best Picture because of <coughs> the fact that it was um, uh, snubbed. Yeah. Uh, the Return of, of the King. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you said that last time, innit? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But for me, but for me, without a doubt, without a doubt, it's got to be the Dark Knight. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Let me like, go first. Let me. You know what I mean? Uh, like Heath Ledger, Christian Bale. It's, come on. Come you on. You know. You know. You know what? It's a tough one because it's tough. It is hard because like. Didn't you fall asleep in the Batman? I don't know. No one's talking to Thank you, Mark. Sorry, Thank sorry, you, Mark. Sorry, Mark. No one's talking to you. Lads, it's my turn to talk. It's not sorry, your turn sorry, to talk. Go ahead. Who invited this guy? <laughs> so, I didn't fall asleep. I'll, anyway, so. <laughs> No, no, no. They were snoring. (laughs) So, um, yeah, what Heath Ledger did as a Joker, it redefined who the Joker was. Mm. Like, it was, it was, um, it was masterful. It was almost, um, it was haunting. And I think what he put on screen was not just Joker. It was a broken person. It was a a tormented person that became the character in which he is, in which he was, the Joker. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I, I sound like hash, yeah. innit? <laughs> <laughs> but um, no, 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 in all, in all fairness, um, fairness, if that movie was just about Heath Ledger, yeah. the Joker, yeah. it still would have done bits. But um, I'm a massive fan of the Batman. 
the new Batman ticked every single box for me. I like I. I think if if I am look, I'm going to go with my head, not my heart. Uh-huh. Yeah, because if I go with my heart, I'm going to have to go with um, the Dark Knight. Yeah, but with my head and what I wanted from a Batman, what I was screaming out for a Batman came in the form of the Batman. The Batman. I yeah. wanted a detective. I got a detective. <clears throat> so. What say you so, want? So, so, so Mark, you're <coughs> the tiebreaker. This no, wait, wait, wait. See, have you not done your picks? Yeah. It's, yeah, Dark Knight. Dark Knight, Dark Knight? No, no, no. Dark Knight, Batman. Yeah. I love Freudian slip there. Yeah, he's like, so I, I've I've rewatched again both of them recently, yeah. And I've, I think that's I'm on like the maybe the tenth time now. I've watched the the new Batman. Nice. I love it, absolutely nice. love yeah. it. But I'll start I'll start with the Dark Knight. It's just again, obviously can't go wrong with the Joker. But it's just I wanted more from Batman himself. Mm. Mm. You know, you wanted to go because that's why I love the Batman because it is pure him. Just nothing else. Yeah. He's I spent I think he spent like ninety percent as the Batman, yeah. and he was only the, his mask was Bruce Wayne, yeah. and then he went Batman. And being a love of the Arkham games, and when he got his metal suit on, yeah. I was like, shit, man. Yeah, <laughs> he's got his suit from the game <laughs> yeah. on, and he goes in there and he does some proper detective work, and I think yeah. this is this is awesome. But when I first saw it, it was Robert Pattinson. Ah, oh, mm. not Twilight man. Mm. <laughs> mm. We're no, going down me, the Twilight route now, but no, it just it was for me with Robert Pattinson. I thought it was fantastic casting. It was yes. the best possible casting. End up being well done. Ever since, ever since Twilight, he has tried to work with the best directors. Yeah. Tried yeah. to do the best films, even do art house films. Actor. Like, yeah. and he's shown like range and stuff he like that. He has range, and, and he's built up a body of work now that now he's doing the Batman. It's like you it, know, it you makes know, sense. Say, you know, you know what. Tenant was his initiation for me. Really? Yeah. Okay. When I watched him in Tenant, I was like, "Fair dues, like, yeah, go for it, man. Mm. You're like, get your bag." But anyway, go on, what? Yeah. But I was like, but you know, this is probably going to be an unpopular decision. Yeah. But I'm going to, I'm going to have to go with the Batman because <sighs> it's not only it's. Not is it because of the story, which I loved. Mm-hmm. Not is it because of Robert Pattinson <laughs> again. <laughs> Look how happy is. Because I loved, and we didn't even mention the Batmobile. Yeah. Jesus, yeah. Mo- yeah. when that first came onto the screen, I was I watched it in the IMAX, yeah. and when that the rumble, sound. my word, yeah. that rumble. But then it's the music as well. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah the, the, the music, the sound of that was incredible. Yeah. Oh man, that, Look, goosebumps, goosebumps. It's crazy. It's crazy. You, you love it. You love can't it. talk Absolutely about that it. film without mentioning Colin Farrell. That, oh, that's Penguin. The, that's the Penguin. Amazing. Yeah. Can't wait for his series of the yeah. Penguin. Oh, that's the amazing mate. He, he, yeah. So, so could you just make could you make that official though, please? Yeah, oh, so I, I'll, I, as much as it hurts me to do so, is, uh, I'm going to go with the Batman. Batman. It's, it's crazy. official. I love it. By the way, love it. you know, no, 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 you know no, no, The Dark Knight no, was, no. was uh, nominated for multiple Oscars and won one Oscar as well. That's, that's, yeah, that's yeah, yeah. Pleasure, yeah. Pleasure, yeah. Best, best so what does, what does that mean to me? I'm just saying. I'll say this in it before. No, no, because we had a Pulp Fiction conversation not too long ago. Yeah. Which is ridiculous, by the way. I'm surprised I'm still not... That's a conversation for another day. Okay, listen, sorry, sorry. About the Dark Knight, I'll just say quickly because I think it's making a thing. I obviously I love bias. no, I love both movies. Yeah, I was probably gonna pick the Batman if I had a choice in this. The thing is about the Dark Knight, I think it's a perfect movie, but as Batman, for me, not the best personally. And I one thing about those Dark Knight series I hate so much is the choreography of fighting. I don't know what it is, but I hate it so it's been uh, 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 and all of that stuff. That's I just it. that's I the only that's like the only negative point from yeah. Dark Knight is this is, is those actual those hand hand when they yeah. brought Matt um yeah Bane in um Matt, I can't remember his Rises. name. Oh uh, um, Dark Knight Wise in I can't remember his name now. Tom who, Hardy, Tom Hardy, yeah. When they brought the Bane in and like the, the physicality of yeah. him and then the fight scenes with him in it were mm. intense. Mm. And they're the kind of things you want from the Joker yeah. and the Joker's yeah. goons, but we just sort of You are missing that. Do you yeah. do you find this is just this is actually sort of a jab on Batman itself, not the movies. Do you find with the Batman, it's more about the villain than Batman itself? I think so. Depends on the film. Really I think point, you actually, need the villain to be good, though. Isn't no, it? But, yeah. but but everything about Batman, the entire Batman sort of universe, yeah. it, it's more about the villain than Batman himself. He's got like he's no, got no, the best. He's got the best rogues gallery. He's yes, nothing without yeah, his villains. That's yeah, the yeah. thing. Isn't but again, it? I think he needs someone to get the most out of, out him. of him. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. I think he needs a he needs a worthy mm. dance partner. Kind yeah. of. Yeah. I mean, My Christian, turn. Christian Bell spoke about this in an interview one time. He was like, if the he spoke like with the, um, Christopher Nolan, if the the usually with Batman. It's the villain that stands out the most. So if yeah. the villain isn't good, 
then Batman's was going to come off boring, isn't yeah. it? So that's why he was so happy with like Heath Ledger and things like that. So, but yeah, especially the Riddler, the Riddler. Yeah, in the in the, in the, the Batman. One, I yeah, mean, the what? And uh, what what a good, good bit of casting as well. Yeah. Well, the Batman advances to the next round. Kem, your time. My Two time. numbers. One and thirteen. One and thirteen. Okay. So number one, we've got Watchmen. Ooh. Yeah. Good, and number 13, Constantine. Oh, that's oh. hard. That's hard. No, yeah. that's hard. That's so hard. This is, this is good that we're doing this. Let's, let's start with Constantine first, because I, I watched that. I remember I remember I read the comic, and imagine, this is so bizarre, it's so coincidental. Yeah? I read the comic, and then, like, without knowing, like, two months later, the movie came out. Mm. I was like, I couldn't believe it. I was like, I, I thought, like, I mean, God was smiling <laughs> on me. I was like, I was, I, was, I was so shocked. And I watched the film, and I was like, I was, initially, when I first watched it, I was disappointed. The first time I ever watched it, I was disappointed. Then yeah. I rewatched it, like, <clears throat> I think about, like, a couple, like, the start of the pandemic, I, re- I rewatched it. I was like, this is not bad. Mm. This is not bad. Mm. This is a decent movie. This is, it's got some great action set pieces in it. Um, the ending wasn't as bad as I remembered it was. But yeah, I, like, I, again, it was great casting to have Keanu, by the way. Like, really good, considering, like, the time as well and how hot he was at the time. Yeah. Like, mm. to get I, him. No, no, no. You know no, I mean? no, no, because it it was um it was a minute after the major, or was it? It was a, it minute. Was a while after the major. So yeah. I don't think he was no. popping because after the major, because it was speed was the big deal because that's really sort of what, like catapulted him. Yeah, yeah. speed. Yeah. Yeah. And then when he done the major, really? after point that, break actually, point break actually. No? It was it? I think it was it was about quite some time after. Yeah, the but major. I'm just saying he weren't they really classed it as the matrixist, yeah. didn't they? Because but yeah, he weren't he weren't re- <laughs> really kicking on though, was yeah. he? At that point, it, it, he was Keanu Reeves. It, was, it was a big get to get Keanu Reeves yeah. from the Matrix. Oh, was it? Yeah, it okay, was fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. Yeah. I think he actually wanted to do it as well because he's pushing for the second one as well now. Even second now, yeah. he still wants to do yeah. that second yeah. one. I love, Keanu, I love Keanu Reeves, man. Come, let's get our picks because I want, I want, I want to pick. I want to pick. No, but again, sorry, but again, like also Watchmen too. So, no, no, we'll get there. You can't do all of it. Yeah, go on. But the Watchmen, like, I still don't understand why it was so hated at the time when it first came out. I don't, I don't get, get it. it either. Like, I don't get I, it either. When I first watched it, I was like, did, did people not watch the same film I just watched? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, this was fantastic. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, there's one actor in it who played Rorschach. Um, yes. He was, he was in that show that I love called The Human Target. Yeah? Fantastic actor. I think his name is, I think, Jackie Lee Early, I think his yeah, name is. Yeah, Early, yeah, yeah. Phenomenal actor. Yeah. He's, I've mm. always loved everything he's ever done. And him, especially the scene when he's in prison, yeah. with, with, the, with, the, with the with the oil. Yes. I'm not locked in here with you. <laughs> You're not locked in here with me. me. No. That, that is so by far good. one of my favorite scenes. Yeah. Of yeah. So one of many. Yeah. One of many. And like when Doctor, uh, like Doctor Manhattan, I think was was really played well. Like yeah. Billy cried up from top to bottom. That movie's fantastic. Like you guys talk a bit more about when, it. When we saw when I first saw Doctor Manhattan, and he was there. You know, he splits himself out. You know, and he goes off with his wife. And he's like, <laughs> What a good man. <laughs> <laughs> if I could do that now, split myself off, I'll be in the room, you know, playing a bit of Xbox, and yeah, she's getting all the loving she needs. I was like, yeah, you. She was so pissed off. She was so pissed off when she realized. <laughs> yeah. well, I'm not gonna lie to you, you watch that thinking, oh, I wish I could do that. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. I, I remember when we first got to see it and just think, because he, he's a completely nude human being, mm. and just think, oh, it's a, that is one big thing on the screen. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, that's, <laughs> the design is crazy. Yeah. 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 It's, but it's so accurate. I mean, because yeah. I own, I actually own two versions of that. I yeah. own the um, the the standard edition and yeah. the, the graphic novel. Yeah, the yeah. different and the, the the director's edition. Okay. Oh, the movie. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I actually do own a digital version yeah. of the um, the graphic novel yeah. as well. So fantastic! Absolutely yeah. love it. By the way, love it. And what I loved about it more than anything else was how Zack Snyder really, really was like so true to the story. Like mm. the same panels yes. that were in the comic. Were actually put on screen. Yes. Do you think? Do you yeah. think people's issues with that is just too long? No, his issue, the people's issue, general issue, from what I understand, is that he was too, uh, he was too, he, he kind of like, he stuck to the source material too much. Too much, yeah, yeah. And but I don't think that's a yeah, bad thing. I don't think for that for that specific story because again, it was long yeah, the movie, yeah. but I think because the the graphic novel was so good. And it's such a well-told story, kind of similar to we'll talk about a bit later on to the last us, where you can't really go wrong when you have a great story and great source material. It's yep. hard to go wrong. Just you know that, what I mean? Like yeah, Zack Snyder has made a lot of films which I do not like because he's kind of gone his own way. But with this one, he kind of stuck to a plan and it absolutely it's more delivered. of a passion project. Yeah, mm-hmm. I mean, yeah. as I enjoyed Constantine because you know I 
great fan of Keanu. Didn't yeah. know anything about Constantine. Mm. Really? No, I didn't, didn't oh, okay. nothing early on. We had to find out. We'd, well, after the film came out, I thought, hang on, is he supposed to be English? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's yeah. supposed to have a red coat. Yeah. But then, um, but then, I, but you can't really compare Constantine to the Watchmen because if, if if I was to sit down and watch the Watchmen, to me that's a that's a, a, an event. Yeah, it's a long event. It's like watching Lord of the Rings again. It's yeah. like watching a massive long film. You're not there I for agree. a small part. You're there for you know the, the whole story. Yeah, that's why I love the bracket, man. Stoss got to die. I love it. Yeah, <laughs> we'll see you. Oh, it's a hard one for me, man. Yeah, I love. Cont- I love. I, I've seen Constantine so many times. I actually, it's one of those movies where you know we ain't got nothing to do, and you want to watch something good, you stick it on because you're still gonna watch it all the way through. Yeah. It's a brilliant movie, man. But Watchmen is, Watchmen is Watchmen, man. Yeah, it's different. Like, yeah. there's so many, there's so much stuff in Watchmen that, um, that you could like. It just takes it, it you, you, you feel that you're in, a, you feel that you're watching a DC movie. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Constantine, you don't get that all the time. Yeah. Sometimes you literally, if you, if you, ne- if you never knew Constantine was a part of the DC world, DC universe, it wouldn't shock you to find out. You're like, oh my god, oh. Like it's yeah, it's yeah. not, but Watchmen, you know, yeah. it's a part of a superhero sort of universe. Constantine, you could you could literally put it off as a, a standalone movie and not not know. Yeah, I would have to I have to go to Watchmen, man. Even though I don't want yeah. to. Watchmen was watch one of the first, also uh, like um, superhero stories that kind of critiqued the whole kind of superhero genre as well. Yeah, mm-hmm. and I thought it done that in a really really tasteful way as well. Like one of the first before obviously the boys and and so many others yeah. who have, have come after it. Um, so what's it for you? The Watchmen. What's it what you want? Yeah, I'm saying the Watchmen. Watchmen. Clean, 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 clean sweep. Yeah, clean sweep. Watchmen advances to the next round. Damn. I mean, honest. You know, I, I did I, I that. That Watchmen. was a David and Goliath battle right there. I don't think it's. I don't. I don't, I don't think it's so much of a David. Yeah, it was. <laughs> it was, man. I love Watchmen. I mean, Constantine is such a cool character in my opinion. Like, yes. Reading him and stuff like that. He's funny. All of that stuff. Mm. The magic aspect is cool. But Watchmen, though, like you said, it's an event. You're there yeah. for the whole ride and stuff. And they're not even like A-level characters, but the story is so A-level that it's just like, they even Ooh. brought them back in like a recent run, um, the Doomsday Clock yes. and stuff like that. And I'm just like, wow, okay, fair enough. Like That's the thing that I actually want to talk to you guys about. Yeah. Um, like sort of back B-level class, B, B-class, B-class level, act- um, act, not actors, a character characters. Story, yeah. Have, um, having their say in these movies, yeah. and it's a different conversation I want to have at a different time because it goes, it sort of t- speaks about Ant Man. It's and like the whole Iron Man thing. Iron Man was B level. Then he B- became B- B- level. But he, Jr. Hawkeye, yeah. Um, yeah. Falcon, all these guys are B level. Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, that's, that's the best one. That's the best perfect example. But go on, um, who's next? Mark, back to you. Two numbers, bro. Oh, what we got? Um, so I go, I, I go with one. No, I've done one. One picked. Oh damn! Ah, you're the first person to make yeah. this thing. Oh no! Come on, <laughs> we're gonna edit that. <laughs> uh, I go with two and sixteen. Is sixteen? Yeah, two we got three? two. All right. So number two, Zack Snyder's Justice League. The Zack Snyder yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so his his cut. His, his cut. cut just, yeah. Not okay. just Sweden. Zack Snyder's. What was the other number? Sixteen, 16 right? Yeah. Viva Vendetta. Oh, I thought you was about to say, oh, we've got the, the, the Justice League here and this Justice League. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been, like, oh. been fantastic. Let me go first. Let me go first. Go ahead. I'm not even going to talk about it. Just put Zack Snyder through, man. Zack Snyder through I didn't like V for Vendetta. What? I didn't really? like it. Oh, you don't even like it? No, I didn't like it. Oh, man. Wow. That was a great film. That's I didn't a like fantastic it. Yeah, film. I thought yeah. it was pretty really? good. I didn't, I didn't like it. I the film. I didn't like it. Oh, <laughs> when the overture oh, oh. kicks in. And What's it? About- <laughs> You know, no, no. To, oh, to, be, to be fair, I understand. I, understand. I, I don't like it. <laughs> Can you give us some salient, salient points for why you don't <laughs> yeah, like yeah. it? How about uh, that? Give us some. Re- I'm very biased to Zack Snyder's Justice League. You just like that way more. That's and I didn't like V for Vendetta. Okay, let, let me let me absolutely burst this bubble. No, 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 no. Uh, no. Go for it. Go for it. Go for it. The Zack Snyder's Justice League is better than Josh Sweden's Justice League by far, by far. But you know, you know, what the biggest issue is. Do, do not say the Flash Rider. <laughs> Like, Do you not say the flash the issue is that Oh, but the fact that you see lightning coming from him. No, <laughs> it's the, it's the fact that he really is. Yeah. <laughs> crazy, yeah. yeah. It's it's throwing, throwing thing. Yeah, he's gliding, like, oh, isn't it? <laughs> but the thing is, to begin with, that, mo- that, that movie and the idea of the movie was very bad. And it was a very, very bad Which rendition. One? I think the whole kind of like um, idea of the Justice League that Jack Schneider initially had, mm-hmm. that was then obviously ruined by Joss Whedon, oh. wasn't a good idea to begin with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So... I think it was the studio as well got yeah. heavily yeah. involved because I read that um, 
You know, at the beginning of the Joss Whedon version, yeah. where Batman comes down and gets that demon yeah. and he fights mm, that guy, mm, mm, that yeah. was supposed to have been a bigger fight. And Joss Whedon even you know, had it all planned out and it was all filmed mm. and stuff. But the Warner Brothers cut it out. So they cut it down. So yeah. literally, Batman come down, save that thug, destroyed the demon and then sod it off. Oh and that was it. So God. they cut it all yeah. down. And he said, that's, that's another issue. Obviously, it's been absolutely chopped up and ruined by, by, by Warner's Seems, as well. Yeah. But I think... The fact that, again, similar to kind of The Watchmen, uh, which, where it worked, but Zach tried to stay too, uh, too true to the source material. Mm. And it was an absolute detriment here. Where, because he wanted a movie, his initial cut, by the way, I don't know if you might, might know, his initial cut was like six something, yeah, like, like six yeah, and a half hours. Yeah, super long, yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think the longest movie ever made is a movie, a Hungarian movie called Satan Tango, I think. And it's like 11 hours or seven hours or something what like that. <laughs> so like, for it to get to that kind of level, like, it's absolutely ridiculous. So... You have to admire that he has such a vision, though. But like, yeah, he had course. a vision for if this you, whole thing, if you've man. you've got a film like that for like seven or eight hours mm. long, you cut it up. You yeah. don't just cut up the whole film and yeah. then dump it in screen and say, oh, yeah, people are going to watch he, that. They didn't, I think, like, he, even though the studio offered to do, like, a part one, part two kind of thing. Yeah. And he refused kind of thing. And, like, he, 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 he eventually agreed upon the, obviously, the four-hour-ish kind of cut that he has yeah. now. Mm. But, like, again, the movie is too long. Even his cut is way too, it's a better story. The story, like, you understand the story more after watching, the, like, the first kind of jokey-jokey, like, comedic yeah. version that Joss had. But again, it's just, it just wasn't a good movie. But I think place. it's a way, way better movie than the Joss Whedon Way one, better. Like, oh, even, I don't know. I mean, I what? Personally, I, have to say, I, own it, I own both on 4K. Sure. I own it generally. Been out and I, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I love the first Joss Whedon one. So can I say one thing? Will you watch it? <laughs> <laughs> Look, like I keep saying, if you're going to do it right, you do it right. Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you why Blu ray. <laughs> just my, my issue with. So the first one is like, well, the Joss Whedon one. Flash and Cyborg were heavily cut in that. Yes. Mm. And then in the Zack Snyder one, they became like the heart of the oh, movie. Yes. Yeah. It's so important to the movie. And I just thought, I don't know, it brought everything together. More than anything, I'm happy that Zack Snyder got to get his vision out there, innit? Because I thought yeah. he really got done yeah, there. Under very, very Especially with his daughter passing. Well, yeah, yeah, and things like that. I thought it was so it's unfair. The way it happened. Mm -hmm. And then for, stu for studio to do what they did, yeah, they, in that they kind tried of, to take advantage, basically. Yeah, basically. Yeah. What, especially what happened to him, it was kind of horrible. Yeah. Kind of put a dirty stain on the film mm. before it was even released. Absolutely. Um, yeah. So it was a shame. I don't know. I'm I'm gonna go <laughs> V for Vendetta because I love that film. Yeah. I, I've watched it recently. I you watched it at know. least. I'm in double That's, digits. By the way, what yeah. great hand-to-hand -hand combat in that movie. Oh man, especially this the knife scene at the end, and yes. he's like, yeah. "Yeah, you've got bullets, but how long can you take to unload them?" Yeah, yeah, I was like, yeah. yeah he's gonna kill <laughs> some fools. Now he's like, <laughs> and that movie quality. has one like I remember that when I saw that ending of that movie, I was like, "Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wow. So can yeah. I just say something? I just looked over, yeah. Was V for Vendetta written down before we even finished? No, no, I just wrote verses. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> He's just getting ready for the V, yep. The v, yep. So you've, you've lost <laughs> though, I think. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, lost, so you're V for Vendetta? Of course. So V for Vendetta has advanced. Oh, oh, oh my cool. goodness. Go on, um, is it you, Hash? Uh, Mark just went this one, isn't it? So it's Hash, Hash me. Yeah, yeah, that's me. So, yeah, Hash, your turn. Okay, eight and nine. Eight and nine? Oh, 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 nine's already I, gone. Is nine already gone? Nine's already gone. Uh, don't look, Mark. I was, I was just about. I was just literally about to comment okay. on your memories. Your memory's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> eight, eight, and eight and five. Cool. Okay, got the first Superman movie, Christopher Reeves. Yeah. Oh, so the Richard Donner, the original Richard Donner movie. Okay. Versus, you said five. Yes. The Lego Batman movie. <laughs> let, so Mark, let, let, let me Mark start go here. Let me start here. Mark, you go here. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the Lego Batman movie. I love it. <laughs> love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. I love it. I know Christopher Reeves, and he's a bat he yeah. is Superman. And yeah. we all, when you think of Superman, especially when like a, me as a 40 year old man, yeah. you think of Superman. You think, yeah, I know who my Superman is. But yeah. Yeah. Batman, Lego Batman. I, I watched that quite recently with my son, and On I what? still wet my. 4K baby. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's so and good. I though. still it's so good. wet myself. It's such a great film. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. Absolutely love it. So I, I'm gonna stop there because even in a jokey way, they're still true to like the, the story. Yeah, yeah there's yeah, some yeah. great characters in there. They got all of them in there. So you know, good. so good. So the the Lego the Lego movie is like such a great example of because everything should when when you hear a Lego movie of like of like a really pre-existing franchise, you're thinking. 
this is going to be horrifically bad. Like mm-hmm. everything is telling you this is going to be terrible. But then when you have great storytelling and they adhere to all the tenets, you know what I mean, of the yep. actual, you know what I mean, of the genre and the story they're telling. Yeah. It's, it was really, really good. I really, really enjoyed that movie. Again, similar to you, Mark. I'm, I'm always laughing. Like, I think I've watched it like two times in a row. I watched it like fairly close together. I watched it with my brothers and then my sisters want to watch it. So I watched it with them as well. Yeah. Again, same experience. Loved it both times. Mm. But Superman, yeah. the original with, with, uh, with Christopher Reeves, it's such... I, I remember when I watched it, I was like, oh my goodness. Like, it's what... I think one of the main things that got me interested in superhero movies and superhero comics and stuff like that. Mm. I was like, when I found out, I, before I watched that movie, I didn't know that this came from source material comics. Like, mm. Oh, really? That, that intru- so I've got, <laughs> I've got a deep love and a deep connection to this movie. And For what they did at the time, it's yeah. kind of crazy. And it, again, I think the score for that movie is fantastic. Yeah. I think people it's iconic. Score. Yeah, it's, it's iconic. iconic. Yeah. Yeah, it's, they still use it now. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's it's used it yeah. it's yeah. Uses yeah. temporary yeah. music for a lot of kind of like um, action movies as well. Yeah. And like kind of like superhero mm-hmm. movies as well. So yeah, for me, because of the kind of like personal connection I have to it, I have to go with uh, the Richard Donner Superman movie. Now, uh, listen, I, I love the, obviously, as I said, it's iconic Superman. Wait, iconic. hold on. Mark, you said Lego Batman? Yeah, I yeah. said Lego Batman, no yeah. way. Okay. I'm just saying, as I say, I love the superhero movies. Um, I love the, like, the conception of the superheroes. <laughs> <laughs> with, um, with, like, Christopher Reeves and everything. Yeah. yeah. Oh, iconic. <laughs> Let, me Let me land! Let me land! Let me land! Let me land! But now, to be honest, yeah, like, I've got this running joke with my boys in the yard as well. Mm. Like, when my, when Caden knows, anyway, I'm like, I'm oh, Batman. Iron yeah, Man, yeah. like it's 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 like you can't go wrong with Lego, Lego Batman. Man. And the thing about it, it was done so well. Mm. It enabled them to do more in regards to. I think personally, I think that was like sort of like a test, like because you know, like the Lego Movie was mm. like it was like a feeler into like, oh, okay, let's see how this mm. works, and mm. it just hit. Yeah. And they did the Batman, and that hit. Yeah. And then they did the um, Harley Quinn. It, yeah. It's brilliant. Yeah. It's brilliant. I'm gonna have to go with Lego. Yeah, I would say, I mean, Lego. I like it. it, I I would say, like, (laughs) Superman for the time, it was amazing. Like, I think the tagline was something like, will make you believe a man can fly or something like that. Yes, that was Mm. amazing. And just, you know, the fact that the way they did the flying and that. So, obviously, now it looks out there, of course, but. For yeah. what they did at that time, I thought it was pretty incredible. And Christopher Reeves is he was cool in that role. Do you I know mean, we are going back. It's literally forty years, I think. That yeah, film, that it's years. insane. So it's too. Yeah. So, but unfortunately, I'm also going to go with Lego Batman. <laughs> even though, even though my viewers don't mean shit, I'm going to go with Lego Batman. Well, so. I, let me just say this: like, some someone has to lose. So oh, yeah. I'm just saying, like, Hash, don't <laughs> take it personally. He's not trying to get me back from the Godfather, by the way. He's uh, still trying to get me back. That's I'm right. just saying, don't take it personally. I'm just saying, like, I don't mind. I like the, I like to, the to, be, movie. to be fair, I'm with, I am with Ken with the Godfather thing. I've never seen it. <laughs> <laughs> We're playing brackets, yeah? Can we concentrate? Sorry, sorry, it's two on two now. We're we losing credibility. It's crazy. The Lego Batman, Lego Batman advances to the next round. All right. The who, fact that you said losing the credit, we lose the credibility. The next world is like, yeah, Lego Batman <laughs> wins. <laughs> All right, let me go. Let me who go. picked those numbers just now? Hash, you hash, yeah. yeah. Kem, go. Three and four. Four got picked. Three and <laughs> eleven. Oh, cool. Okay. So, Lego Batman movie was obviously one of the two animated movies that was theatrically released from DC. The yes. other one. Yes. Uh, it's already one. It's already the one. other one. It's already one. It's already one. Okay, about in 1992. Yes, it's already one. Batman, Mask of the Phantasm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. Versus. This is a very quick one, guys. Yeah. The first Wonder Woman. This is this is unfair. Are we saying the first one? Are we this talking about the Gal Gadot? Gal Gadot. Gal Gadot. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I have not seen the Batman, Mask of the Phantasm. Miles. Cool. Really? I've not seen. You're it. missing really? the trick. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Check it check out. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait. You're the DC guy, yeah? I know. I know. I know. He's a DC guy. Bad. As soon as you said that, I was like, oh, have crap, let's a, dig that hole. <laughs> have you seen a Batman the Animated Series? Like, um, some from? of it. I yeah. haven't seen much. Of it. It's kind of like a continuation of that, or it's like the prequel of that, isn't it? Yes. I believe, yeah. yeah, yeah. So yeah. You might, you'll, you'll probably like Because when you said the um, the theatrical version, I thought you were going to go, go down the Batman versus Superman. No, to, no yeah. No, no, yeah, I, yeah, I yeah, actually yeah. watched that in cinema. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. So I thought that's the one you was going with. Um, <laughs> like, oh, okay. yeah. Now I took a hole. That, that <laughs> So uh, Wonder Woman. By default, Wonder Woman. By default, you're Wonder Woman. But again, 
I watched one, you know, Wonder Woman, I won't spoil what happened later on, but that iconic music with Wonder Woman, yeah. she comes in, uh, it's just new music, and I love the film. And yeah. I, and, you know. yeah, I thought it was a really good film. I really, I think Patty Jenkins absolutely knocked out the ball. I, I, yeah. I, th I, th I think um, in regards to the Wonder Woman, for what they did for the, with Gal Gadot, it was a really good movie, yeah. really good movie. And fun fact, obviously, post, like I'm talking about, the, 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 um, the file that we have in this country, I actually worked on some of the edits. There was, we've got, anyway. Oh, for this? Oh, yeah, 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 sick. Yeah. When I was working on the Deluxe. Nice. Um, but, you can't you can't go wrong. You have to watch Batman. You have to check it out. Master Fantastic you is such a good movie. You have to check it out. It's got such a wonderful story. And like, mm. it's, it's got some, it's got, I wouldn't say heavy themes, but like, it's a, it's a really, really like, rewarding story. Yeah. And yeah, it's, it's very, very good, yeah. honestly. Unfortunately, yeah. Mark, you're losing this one. Um, it's going to be... It's Listen, you need to watch this tonight, I got, by I the way. I was quite tired, and I was like, yeah, I'm watching it. Yeah, let's, let's go with Wonder uh, Woman. Uh, <laughs> that's crazy. But I think uh, with Wonder Woman, I'm, I'm, I'm even more shocked that it succeeded because I think Gal Gadot's not a good actress. Do you not? No. She, she was someone who's come from modelling, and is, it's a bit hit and miss with like, models that then become actors, stuff like yeah. that. It doesn't usually work that well. Maybe but, that's like, why I liked it. But I thought, I thought like... <laughs> we all know why you liked it. <laughs> I don't, I don't care. Uh, look, um... No I, one's arguing. <laughs> <laughs> I, hey, listen, listen, listen. You may not care about what happens when you get home. I do. I care about my well, eyes. Well, I've saved the fact that my wife will never watch this, so... <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You will see me home now. Like, I'm going to make out? sure <laughs> send this. I'm going to send this to you lot. But anyway, yeah, no, it has to be... Um, Batman. All right, Batman, Master of the Phantasm advances to the next round. So we got four movies left just the numbers. in the round of we 16. Yeah, I'll just give you the numbers. So we got 15, wait, who's next? Mark, right? Yeah. yeah. 15, 14, 12, and 6. 15 and 12. 15 and 12. Okay, so we've got Green Lantern. Oh, no. <laughs> That's amazing. Vers <laughs> That's amazing. Green That's Lantern amazing like that. versus The Suicide Squad, the James Gunn one. Okay. The one with Idris Elba. You, okay. you know, oh. you know, you, you know, you know. Sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. Yes. No, no, no. Let me go first. Yeah. The way how people's like, oh yeah, the Suicide Squad, not Suicide. They're bullshit. No, hold on a second. <laughs> hold That's a bold on. statement. Right? Hold on a second. <laughs> sorry, do you want me to say it again? The Suicide Squad is one of the funnest movies I've seen in the last no, no, couple no, no, of years, no, no, man. No, no, no. It's so fun. It's shit. Why? Elba and John Cena. John Cena was great. They made a spin-off TV so good, show. They made, a, they made him a t whole TV show. Come on, Kev. Come on, Kev. Have you watched Peacemaker? Come on. This, this is. Uh, am I speaking? You're speaking. Okay, so safe space, Kev. It's a safe space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank it's you very much. Not yeah. that safe, but yeah. <laughs> they're, they're both shit, yeah? So if you're going to shit on um, the, the William Smith, yeah, for his. Um, it's actually shot, Willard Smith. Willard. I don't care. Come it's okay. Smith. It's Willard. I don't care. <laughs> I'll slap you. I'll slap you. Um, no, no, all jokes aside, I, no, no, I get the fun aspect to it. Yeah. I get it. Yeah. Mm. As a fan of DC and wanted to see something good, I was not there. I didn't like it because I be, because there was so much of a um, like a sort of a build up of oh don't worry it's not Suicide Squad Suicide Squad it's the Sui it's going to be better James Gunn and I expected so much more from James Gunn in my opinion I didn't want too much fun I didn't want fun because you have to understand that these are villains that's James yeah. Gunn's mo though I don't fun. care that's what he does to be fair you are up against the Green Lantern so you know yeah. you're saying trying to yeah. comparing yeah. You're, you're, you're comparing a turd with a turd. Yeah. Mark, let me land. Let me land. Yeah. <laughs> to me, it's a shiny turd though. It is. Yeah. Yeah. It is. The sparkles on top. Yeah. 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 They have, did I, polish I have, a turd right I there. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't got. I haven't gotten to my argument now. So with Suicide, Suicide Squad and this was they're bullshit. Yeah. Green Lantern is dog poo. Yeah. So by default, I have to go with shit. So I have to go with. The Suicide Squad. Alright. Alright. Uh, well, you see. Let's talk about Green Lantern a bit, a bit, though. No, we don't want to do that. Because that suit I was incredible. I enjoyed that film. I don't, I'm going to put it out there. I actually enjoyed that Yeah, Mark, that you film. go. You go, you go. I enjoyed the Green Lantern film. It was fun. I didn't know much about the Green Lantern before I watched it. And yeah. then I read up on it. Obviously, it's wildly shite when you come. You mean you read, you know, the backstory. Yeah. But yeah. how yeah. for a film, yeah. as with Ryan Reynolds, I actually really enjoyed it. So, Can, can I just put one thing out there before you continue? Green Lantern is John Stewart. 
Yeah, that's it. Should, it. I mean, it should be. It's quintessentially it. meant I mean, to be No, no, there's no I mean. No. Yeah, Hal Jordan is. He's cool. He's cool. Wait, what he, are you trying to say? The best Green Lantern is this? 100%. Or you're saying the Green Lantern should be all. It should. It should. No, no. Like, Hal Jordan's good. Hal Jordan's fun. I get the Maverick aspect yeah, in Hal Jordan. Yeah. But if you are going to put out a Green Lantern movie, like, especially like a, the first one. Mm. Do it right with John Stewart. For me, it left I, a bad taste in my mouth because of that. When I saw it, when I saw it, was just only Hal Jordan and not John Stewart, I was very upset. I was very upset because when, when I think of Green Lantern, I first think of you know what I mean. Did you guys the, watch? The, 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 did you guys watch the Justice League cartoons? Is that why? The, the, of course, yes, from the day. that's probably that's that's, from that's the another day. reason. But I also, see. I read I read the comics as well. But Hal Jordan has always been like the main one. No, no, no. He no. has. Man. Hal Jordan's cool, but John have you read, have you read, no. have you read the run though? The, 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 the Green Lantern. Bear runs. Bro, so it's not. It's not. Why are you saying that? How Jordan, Jordan is usually like a lot of the Green Lantern stories. How Jordan is the main guy. John Stewart is there for me. Okay, personally, I put them both as the same, and then all the other Green Lanterns come after that. Yeah. That's why this TV show that James Gunn has announced. I'm so glad it's both of them. Yeah, doing it, a, it was always gonna be a that. detective cop yeah. thing, right? Yeah, but. Because it was how Jordan, I wasn't mad at that. I can't say I was mad at that. Okay. And I like Ryan Reynolds. But then, no, no, then Ryan to Reynolds not have John... <coughs> okay. You know what? Hash, hash, Don't hash, be mad! Hash, cool. <laughs> hash, cool, cool. Hash, I'm on your side this one. I swear down I'm on your side. <laughs> okay, well, what was your pick? <laughs> what was your pick? I can't remember what the other film was now. So, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, no, I'm sorry. Suicide Squad, Suicide Squad. Yeah, Suicide Squad. Yeah, I have to go with Suicide Squad. I really enjoyed that film. Not I, I enjoyed it because I enjoyed it and I thought it was a way better fun movie and it had a better story than the, yeah, than the first uh, one. Yeah, I had to go with Suicide Squad. Oh, oh so poor no, Jared Leto. Uh, I did feel for him. I mean, you could see from yeah. me, you know, interview, post interview, he was a broken man. I mean, yeah. they ruined the Joker in that film. Yeah, no, no, it's such for, a shame. For, for me, the, 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 um, the Suicide Squad man, the guy, the, the poker guy was amazing. Oh my God, he was incredible. He, he, I'm he sorry, was, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. When he, he was seeing he was people and he was envisioning his mum, that shit was hilarious. Was hilarious. I'm on. so Come sorry. On, that's, that's when so he's funny. in the club dancing and he's <laughs> his mum, that shit was funny, bro. It was funny. It was, oh, yeah. man, it was, was very, very like, oh, like it's so weird sick. and uh, very, 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 very Absolute sinister. Absolute quality. But, yeah. Absolute quality. <laughs> it's, it's uh, rubbish. That was some disturbing shit going very on yeah, <laughs> It was just so funny. It was rubbish. All right, so Suicide Squad advances to the next round. So, actually, it's on you. I'm just going to tell you the two movies left. Justice League, <laughs> Just Justice Justice League. League. <laughs> I should have oh. ran an audible and taken this out, but it's here. Uh, Joss Whedon's Justice League versus Man of Steel. That's unfair. Just put Man of Steel through, man. I'm you not know, even you know what? Okay. No, it's you know what? Okay. It's so hasty. Great. All right, all right. Okay, okay. What? I love this. Let's hear him out. Good, good, good. Man of Steel, it was a good film, but I never classed it as a Superman film. I love oh, the film. Okay. Don't get me wrong, but you know, coming back from the what we were talking about earlier, from my ideal of what Superman is, is Christopher Reeves. He is that clean cut human being doing what, not killing someone if he has to. Mm. I get what Zack Snyder did, and you know, Zod had to die or that mm. fam, but for the tone and the carnage he caused. He destroyed a whole city mm. for no real reason, and then they put dubstep in it just for the the things going up and down. I was thinking, <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> dubstep. <laughs> dubstep yes. Okay, okay. So, I need to attack that. <laughs> I actually love this movie. Me too. I love Man of Steel. Love it. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, I love okay, it. Right. I, I wouldn't say love it. Okay. I love yeah, it. I, I mean, calm it down. <laughs> then they brought out. Then they brought out Man, uh, uh, Superman versus Batman. Oh no, 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 no. D don't, don't conflate. Don't conflate. Man of Steel and Superman versus Batman. That's two different. That's two different movies. Yeah, I could understand. Well, I, I, I love. I love Henry, uh, Henry Cavill. Henry yeah. Cavill as Superman. Batman. Superb. He Batman. looks. You see what I did there? You see what I did there? Oh, God. <laughs> Shut up, Ken. <laughs> <laughs> but he is. I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean. You know, when I saw Black Adam, the mm. best part of that whole film was seeing Henry Cavill come back mm -hmm. as Superman. Yeah, I agree. And it was and then, just quality. Then, but then this gets absolutely taken out straight but, away. But, 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 yeah. quick, quickly, have you not seen the um, the teasers what um, uh, Zack Snyder um, um, put out there? Zack Snyder? Oh, he's doing a... Um, oh, the old Dark Sage thing. So I heard Dark Side that... Message, yeah. Yeah. Apparently... Apparently it's going to be an animated continuation. Mm -hmm. That's what I heard, but I don't know. No, apparently there's going. He said obviously there's a beginning and there's always going. It has to go to be. Yeah, yeah. So I think he's going to complete 
what but I don't think it's live action though. I'm hoping it is. Because I don't, I don't know is. if Warner Brothers will. I, yeah, I, I don't yeah. think Warner Brothers will. I think Warner's right. Warner's right, Ken. I think it will, it will unfortunately will be only anime. To yeah, be fair, to be fair if, either if way, I still think they're going to make a whole Batgirl film and then oh, ditch no, it. No, no. Yeah, it, it they, was, they are. They, they're more than happy to ditch this whole universe and start yeah. fresh. Fair enough, fair enough. Yeah. Anyway, it's a shame. It's a yeah. shame because it, it, hopefully they do go full circle. I would love it. I think I think the main part is like for Man of Steel, I'm not going to talk about Justice League, I hear, but for Man of Steel, I think, like Mark I said, had, I, I enjoyed it. I, I enjoyed I it. it. I couldn't do it. Man. I couldn't do it. It was just my cup of tea. You know, it's fair. You can watch you it with my cup of tea. Okay, can, can, can I can fair. It's fair. No, no, no. You know what this cup of tea sounds it, like? Chamomile with milk. Oh, my God. That's horrible. What's oh. going on here? Chamomile. Yorkshire tea all day long, man. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like a chamomile tea with milk. Like that. It's just, <laughs> it made me laugh because, you know, when, especially when Superman grabs old Batman and goes, oh, do you bleed? And he drops Batman and thought, <laughs> something's bleeding. <laughs> That's my kind of humour. That's oh, my kind man, of humour. And yes, Kim, I own it on 4K. 4K! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I've like, got it, I've got it. I've watched it hundreds <laughs> of times. I'm literally into the double, maybe in the triple digits when it comes to that film. Would oh. you uh, prefer to watch that over Zack Snyder's one? I will prefer to watch the Joss Whedon one first. Hey, look, look, Mo, 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 can, I, can, I, can, can I just say something? I like, I, it's a lighter film. Can, and I, I, get can I say something, yeah? Moving from could we, the next round, yeah. Mark has no, <laughs> he has no voice <laughs> in this if he's going to say, make that statement. Yeah, you have to give up your seat to anyone, it's to anything. Fair, it's fair, I'm, it's, I'm fair, not, it's fair, it's fair, it's fair, it's fair. Cheers, lads. <laughs> All right, let's do it. All right, let's do picks, let's do picks. Kem, Man of Steel, you said already, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Has she? It has to be Man of Steel. Yeah. I would have gone to Justice League, but it's okay. madness. Well, Justice Man of Steel League. advances. Justice League. Justice League. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, go I, just, on. I don't know, man. Like, well, that, that movie Man of Steel has a great Michael Shannon performance as well, by the way. Special, yeah, is, yeah. special place to in my To be fair, I mean, he, he saved that film. Yes, he did, yeah. Brilliant. He was, because, really uh, what was that? Um, I can't remember that. Uh, what was that film? The Empire. Um, I can't remember that TV show that he was in. That he was in. Oh, um, Boardwalk Empire. Boardwalk Empire. Yeah. He was a nutcase in that. So yeah. to see him come on and be even more of a bigger nutcase mm. was awesome. He's great. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys, we're in the quarterfinals. We've got four matchups. We have to speed up. Yeah, we have to be quick with this one. All right. Match number one. Batman Returns versus The Batman. The Batman, Batman Returns. Me. Sorry. I love it! <laughs> I love it! Straight Straight I Straight love in. it. I love, you know, everyone knows I love The Batman. I mean, any, it, I will talk that up all day long. But my no. childhood... Michael Keaton is your Michael Batman. Michael Keaton, it, to me, He's is, literally on is your back. Batman. He's literally he is literally on my back. Yeah. All right, all right, if all right. I was to turn around Michael Keaton and he, he you know... Yeah. I can't, I just couldn't do it, I couldn't do it. Okay, it's, on, okay. it's on you then. Listen, you're no, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hash, I swear to you, bro, Yeah. this will define our friendship. <laughs> Don't do that to me, please, okay. please, 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 Hash. Hash, I'm, no. Hash, I'm saying please. Listen, it's a good film. You know, Cam, Sorry, Hash, Cam, Cam will return. Listen, <laughs> <laughs> listen I, I think, first of all, I just want to say, like, I can't wait for Michael Keaton to come back and reprise his role. I cannot wait. Yep. Literally, it's one of the films I'm really, really looking forward to th uh, this year. Yeah. Um, obviously, I don't want to ruin kind of like me and Kem's friendship. This guy, you know, you did on purpose. But again, I think you're right. You're okay, right, thank you. You know what I mean? But I have to go with Batman. Are you crazy, bro? You know what I mean? Why am I going to... I'm going to go with the Batman. The Batman. Crazy. No way, no way, no. Batman Returns. Hell yes. 100%. Oh, you see what you did there? Yeah, yeah. You see what you did there? Nah. Get out of here oh, about friendship. Snap. Get out of here about friendship. <laughs> okay. This guy. It's a meritocracy. He's got, okay. got to put it through. Back Come on, bro. Is Michael Keaton. Iconic. It's Michael Keaton. Come on, bro. Is this an upset? Hash. I mean, uh, Mo, no, Mo, 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 no Mo, Mo, these guys, they are, they're, not, they're not right. Can we go to the next round, please? <laughs> they're not right. Woo, all right. I know if you had your vote. I know yeah, if I you going, had your vote. I was going to the Batman. Yeah, I was going to the Batman. I think we do this every episode. All right, matchup number two. Watchmen yeah. versus V for Vendetta. Oh, Watchmen. <laughs> oh, God, I was, I was going free for Vendetta then. <laughs> I love this. Again, this is, it's a difficult one, but I think it, the answer is very clear. I think V for Vendetta is a great movie, but it's got to be Watchmen. Watchmen. It sounded like, like you, you had soap in your mouth. You didn't want to side with me. Jeez, this one's tough, crazy. you know. Shut up, bro. You don't have a pick, Mo. <laughs> oh, yeah, shit. Oh, man. <laughs> wait, so wait, what one? Watchmen? Watchmen? Yeah. Okay, first. All right, so Watchmen advances to the next round. Uh, third matchup for the quarterfinals. We've got the Lego Batman movie versus Batman Mask of the Phantasm. So Ooh. you're going to be Lego, Lego Batman. Batman yeah. I think, yeah, Lego yeah, Batman, yeah. Lego Batman. Mask of the Phantasm is just an absolutely outstanding movie. It's like, it's one of the best. If they could do that in live action, I, w I would watch that in a heartbeat, by the way. 
If they could do that swear, you have to watch him up. Literally yeah, tonight, I'm if you can. Tonight. Yeah, I yeah, say yeah. I'm going home tonight. Kill? Yeah, it's going to be Batman. Yeah. What's that? It's going to be Batman. Well Which done. one? It's not, well done. There's not, two Batmans here. Not, yeah, not, well not, not, Le- not Lego. Not Lego. Monster the Phantasm. Oh, he's yeah. upset because he's agreeing with me. Actually. Yes, that is why. <laughs> yeah, that yeah. is why. I know, I know, I know you can. Uh, it's not, I didn't think Monster the Phantasm would go through. Yeah. I'm like having it's, an argument with your wife and you have to agree with her because you know you're wrong. <laughs> 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 All right, last matchup of the quarterfinals. We've got the Suicide Squad versus Man of Steel. Because of, there's such great performances in the movie, I'll go with Man of Steel. Okay. I will go with Man of Steel on yeah. this one. Mark? Yeah. I will go with Man of Steel on this, on yeah. this occasion because I don't, it's, although I, I, pref- I would prefer. You know, the way I'm judging that, squad, yeah. but the Man of Steel is a better film as compared a to yeah. as a yeah. film. Yeah. As the a way movie. I'm judging it is like, which one would I watch tonight? And it would yeah. be the Man of Steel. Yeah, clean sweep. Yeah, no, I agree. All right, that's all right. We got our semi final matchups. Oh snap! Okay, first matchup: Batman Returns versus Watchmen. Batman Returns. I didn't think Batman Returns would get this far. <laughs> this is so cool. I'm just so happy it was brought up in the first place. Yeah. I was like, yes. <laughs> so, quick question: Would you have preferred if I put that or the first Batman '89 one? This one, I think. Because I was I looking at ratings, the Returns was a bit higher, I think. But yeah, I think even Michael Keaton himself preferred the second one. Interesting, because yeah. um, they had more fun with it. Yeah, yeah. Sam, you can tell they and had they more did a fun lot with more. It. They did a lot more. Yeah, it, it was the last. I think the last film to use um, small. Um, like toy cars to blow things up yeah. oh. to make it look realistic. Yeah, models, yeah, it was yeah. the last thing, to, last yeah. film to do it, and they actually built proper, you know, sets. You say, mm. like, again, yeah. nothing really was CGI, and you could tell that. Mm. Granted, it, some of it doesn't hold up to today, yeah. but yeah. still, great film. And yeah, so the, it would have been the second one for me. I loved the first one as well, because yeah. again, grew up with that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But as soon as the second one came out with the penguin mm-hmm. and Michelle Pfeiffer, mm-hmm. <laughs> there, you yeah, yeah. there you go. There you go. I think, by the way, fun fact, uh, miniatures were used again for The Dark Knight. Oh, really? really? Which yeah. you man didn't vote for, but anyway, we'll continue on. That's all right. That's all right. Didn't make <laughs> anyway. it. Um, People are going to be mad The Dark Knight isn't this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, no. Of course. By the way, have you, have you noticed throughout all of these brackets, I have been the voice of reason? You know what I mean? Like, what? Yeah. Parasite. You know, if you yeah, think I mean, about it, the popular one had never won, you know? Exactly. The, the one, one that makes the sense. The one that makes so sense never won because of you. <laughs> can, can, can yeah. you can but you this is our bracket. And that's okay. Okay. So, Hashi, Batman Returns or Watchmen? This is a very difficult one for me. Oh. I'm going to have to push you for an answer, sir. So. With a heavy heart, yeah. the Watchmen. A heavy heart, the Watchmen. Watchmen. So, you got one Batman Returns, one Watchmen. Hey, Kevin. Kevin he loves this. Me. It's on you. You know what? I love the authority. Yeah, I know <laughs> you I love should. the power. I, I love the power. I love the fact you had a smile on your face before we <laughs> come to you. So, like, what, what, what would you say to me anyway? What? <laughs> <laughs> So, <laughs> with a heavy heart, one second. <laughs> with a heavy heart, I'm gonna have to go with Watchmen. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a log ride over with as well. Uh, I'll have you now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do me like that. There's trains today, isn't there? <laughs> no. <laughs> train strike. Oh no, right, there's a train strike. <laughs> so what's uh, our finals, man? Watchmen has gone to the finals. So last matchup of the semi-finals, we've got Batman Mask of the Phantasm versus Man of Steel. Oh, I'm gonna go Man of Steel. Let's just do it quick. Man of Steel. No. No, 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 no. No. Ah. No, what? Ah, brother. <laughs> I will go Batman here, purely because I want to see a Batman in the final, so I will <laughs> go Batman. <laughs> Not because I don't like Man of Steel, I just, I want to see Batman. Thank you, Mark. I've come here for I Batman. I, like <laughs> I knew I like this guy. I come I... here for Batman, I want a Batman in the final. Let's go, let's go. Run it. <laughs> Run it, let's go. go Love it. So what's our final? Oh, by the way, I, I was so scared. I would have gone man of steel personally, so you would have been pissed. But yeah. oh, I would have been because I, I saw by your face you yeah. went. Well, um, yeah, we got our finals and we got our third place matchup. So we go before we go to the finals, we'll do third place. So Batman returns versus Man of Steel. Batman I, returns. I, I don't know how many times I can say Batman, Batman returns, returns. So I'll keep yeah. saying it. That's I'll, fair. I'll yeah. say it till I'm blue in the face. It's Batman returns. It's got to be Batman returns. Okay, please sweep. Batman returns. Yeah, that's our third place winner. But um, finals. Watchmen versus Batman Master you know of the Fantasy. For them. this final matchup, yeah. I am happy either way. I think this is a worthy matchup. You know what I mean? Worthy of a final. Um, mm. Both movies, great stories, wonderfully told. Um, they also, I forgot to even say about the Watchmen, great pacing, by the way. That movie moves as well. Mm. It really moves because really, it's a long movie. You don't feel it. You don't feel it. Mm-hmm. And like. You're not bored. There's yeah, not always bored something 
going on. Yeah. Even when there's a slow point, there's a reason for it, and then it kicks up. Then it's yeah, it's a brilliant film. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. with uh, Master Phantasm, like the animation, even what the design of animation is so. It, it will bring you back to your childhood in terms of what you watched yeah. and stuff like that. It's, it's so, so good. Yeah. And like for it to be so, it, to catch, to capture Batman so sad as well, like him really like grieving and stuff like that. It's just like literally on his, like on his knees. It's, like, it's incredible. It's an incredible okay. movie. But for me, I think for how much it surprised me and it's, this is going to surprise you guys. It's got to be Master of the Phantasm for me. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah, I wasn't. I'm not surprised you picked that. Yeah, but you know how much. Can, I talk can, about can I just it. say one thing? Yeah, so based on the logic that you used earlier on, and the, based on the logic that you went against huh? this, ba- this Batman earlier on, yeah, I'm assuming you're gonna go to Watchmen, right? You don't know. You don't. You don't no, know. You don't know what he's gonna do. No, hold up. How hold up. Hold up. <laughs> I'm asking a question. No, 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 no. It's not his turn yet. It's not his turn Why can't I go last? Because right, well, you wanted to talk right now. You're talking now, so you're going to pick now. <laughs> I was actually going to go Mark next. Yeah. But then you wanted to talk. Okay, can so, I retract yeah. that, please? No, 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 no. Mark's going to get the same vote. What are you picking? What are you picking? Get Sorry, has he just repeat that last sentence again? <laughs> Mark's going to get what? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to go with a watch, man. For watch all man. your reasons that was used earlier on and why it's, it's a brilliant movie. I absolutely loved it. And the reason what Hash was like, the pace of it was amazing. Um, I just want to know what Mark's going to pick. No, I think, I think... Mark's gonna be on the right side of history here, you know what I'm saying? Oh. Don't don't do that. Don't what? do that. You're don't to, do that. You're trying to sway the vote. Isn't it, isn't it? <laughs> you're trying to sway the, you're a politician. Isn't it? Man, <laughs> man, man putting some, See, some paper yeah. underneath the table. It's quite hard for me to pick as much as I don't, don't not but as, as much as I can't pick the watchman, because mm. I've not seen the Batman, mm. the, yeah, the Mars. It's a shame because I really want to see it. Yeah. But I, on this occasion I will go the Watchmen. Yeah. Purely because I own all versions. You okay? I will watch it. Okay. I will okay. go home okay. and I will watch it. Even after say, I will go quite happily go home yeah. and sit there and watch it again. On I, I and you know, see what you on Blu-ray, like. baby. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what? You know what? You, know, you know the sad thing is. <laughs> <laughs> you know the sad thing is for me. Like he's gonna watch it tonight. He's gonna call up Cam. He's gonna be like, I should. I'm okay with that. You I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Guess what? As I said before, hash. It's okay. You know, it's okay. <laughs> it really is okay. <laughs> okay, look, can we can we wrap up? Because we've got um Yeah, let's wrap up. Alright, guys. So Watchmen was the small time critics winner for the DC movie bracket. A surprising. I didn't I'm, think I'm Watchmen. I didn't I'm think happy. Watchmen would win, but it won. I'm so happy. Fa- uh, Master Phantasm got yeah. this far. Phant- it got second. I'm happy. I'm happy. And then we have got Batman Returns f- four, third. Excuse me, and Man is still fourth. So I'm, I'm just happy cool. that you know Michael Keaton got in there. Yeah. As third. I'm a happy man. Yeah. Me, me, and my tattoo can leave happy. That's it. <laughs> 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 but yeah, it's all right, man. Don't be as upset, man. Hey, Watchmen won. So yeah, Watchmen won. Okay. Good. But yeah, that was Tell our movie face. bracket, guys. Huh? Thank you for joining us. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when the videos are coming up, you get a notification. And yeah, hit five stars on Apple Music, Spotify, all of that good stuff. Let us know what you think. Thank you for joining. Peace. Peace. Peace.